Hello and welcome. I'm Dev from above and today I wanted to do a little video on base defense. I got my terrible two Titan Ops on. We got our attacker here who brought three heavy platoons, which is probably more than you would usually face. But the platoon size is not very big since it's not a high level. So I guess that's fair enough. Uh, we are both in the same clan, so we both profit from these clan boosts. So let's see how it goes. Um, right now I still have my base setup from the invasion event, so it's not a PvP setup. I got two gold tempests. I got Jericho to boost my howlers with his tactic. And I got mines all over the spawn locations. Let's see. He can only deploy from these three points and his air will come in somewhere like here. And we got an owl here. For some reason it seems my radio tower is not working properly. And we got Ardra deployed, so let's say hello. He's probably trying to bait me into walking into some other deployed units, but I'm not gonna fall for it. And we can see he got the slow-mo ops activated, but still Ardra is too slow to hunt down the Howler. Now we can see he deployed two Howlers, uh, two Liberators. But that doesn't do a lot either. And he has hit all three spawn mines, so his holder is now not in a good shape. So now we are just playing cat and mouse, but the clock is ticking and so far he hasn't really made any progress. And that really didn't do much. And now we got our owls kicking his ass. Nice. We took some damage on our howlers, but I think so far we still got the upper hand. The watchtower has so much range it even covers the spawn point on that location and he again hit some mines. What we can do now is harass his Ardra while he's probably not looking. And again, the clock is ticking. He deployed the Hydra on the other side by now. And Ardra is gone. And our Liberators are doing their job. He made the mistake of not 
protecting his uh, juggernaut properly. So now we can take some pot shots at it with Jericho, and nobody's there to protect it. And we are lagging out. Juggernaut is gone. We lost a Tempest and a Bunker. And one Railgun, but so far no big deal. The attack is almost over, and I see he deployed a lot of Liberators, but those can't really do much. can just safely mow them down with our howlers since we got bloodhound bullets on it and infantry is simply not a match for them. So now he probably just got legion left alive. And we still got most of our troops. Base is still intact and I see he deployed the legion now. What we can do now is simply beat him down, since none of his units are going to be able to do much to us. And we got hit by a Legion Pulse Rocket. Pretty smart move, but it's not enough. And we just keep kiting slowly walking backwards and killing his units. And we won. So we killed a Juggernaut, a Hydra, I think Roland also, not sure. And he doesn't really have much left. And we are being hit again. Still the same attacker. Now we can see he deployed his air. And we are lagging badly. So he's probably again trying to bait us into making a mistake. Luckily for us, we have pretty nice watchtower here, which covers our Jericho nicely. So we don't really have much to fear. And his Titan is taking quite the beating. And that's the Titan gone. We probably just lost like one Howler, which was already damaged. Didn't even lose a bunker. That was not a good idea from him. Now we got another Owl. And it's dead. Expert Tempest killed it. We can now meet his owls, or at least try to. 
and they are already in range of the bunker. First owl is gone, and since we have a radio tower, we will always be on top of it now. He retreated it, and there it is, and we are killing it. What we could do now is, if we want to be mean, we just park our haulers here, since he only has got this platoon left, and this is his air deploy location. And now he won't be able to do much anything at all, really, basically. Foolishly deploying liberators, which are no match for um, howlers. And now we got Ardra again. That was a good move from him. But she's simply not enough to kill this amount of howlers. We still got one tactic from Jericho left, so what we could try is just bum rush him, but then we don't have a lot of anti-air left, which would be risky. Now we got some cyclones, which can't kill moving targets like the Howler, so they're all gonna die. And Ardra's gone. And Legion is gone. Or if it's not dead, it's almost fully dead now. So he probably just got like some air alive, maybe a sandstorm, something like that. Nothing he can really do damage with us. Damage to us with. And we still don't have one star. That's after three platoons. Still got one tactic on Jericho, and I guess we win. If there would be a second attacker, it's important to repair now. If you have the time, make a ring of fire outside of your base, change on new defenders if you have them, um, try to overdrive your power plants. So you have more power if you need it. And check the repairs. We got 13 hours of damage, so our base platoon took quite the beating. But still we got several units left standing, which would be able to probably still kill a juggernaut if you play it smart. So yeah, that's it. Now we can check the attack log. Forty-three percent and thirty percent damage in the first atta first attack. We see slow mo. That's where the cry was there. Uh, two night owls, Roland died. Attack dogs for mines, I guess. Expert howlers, liberator, elite juggernaut, detonator from Roland, and elite hydra. Level twenty-one hydra, level twenty-five juggernaut. In the second attack, we killed three Night Owls, five Cyclones, which di really didn't do much. Ardra, which was quite a problem to kill. Quite hard to kill. Omega Titan, Liberators, and a Fury. Maybe if you would have um, coupled the Titan with a Night Owl attack, it would have been more effective. But I think against Howlers, uh, you just shouldn't use air, it won't really work. And since we got our missile defense bastion here, he was not able to use uh, missiles. The radio tower uncloaked his owls, so we could snipe them. And since I had my titan ops on over the bastion, it was very hard to reach it. So yeah, that's it. We defend.